Man, he gonna become, I'm a little emotional, man. That, that he's telling the truth, bro. The sad thing is, man, he he probably won't get the recognition that he deserves because he's telling too much truth. This man he, he, is here. You can tell he wrote it. Yeah, he, you can tell he wrote it. He mean it, and it's going. He ain't playing with you. Right. He don't care if you like it or not. Mm -hmm. This is from his heart. Look, y'all, we we need help too. Right. And even though he didn't say it, I feel like. As a country, we, we worry about other countries more than we care about our own. All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Magician the Jock. The magician has changed a little bit this time. Any uh, longtime fans of the channel, this is Chris Bryant, who was my coach growing up. Been a great friend since then, and uh, sadly, Billy couldn't be here, but Chris is back in town from Virginia Beach. Yes, sir. And... Um, He's got some videos lined up for me to react to, and I've got some stuff for him to react to. Let's do it. So, Let's do it. You gonna give the raw reaction? Yes, sir. All right. Yes, yeah. sir. Let's and, do it. And, and those in the comments, if you if you have any videos that you want to see Chris react to, he's a genuine dude. He will tell you if it's lame. He will, <laughs> he will tell you if it's lame. Might just turn it off and start <laughs> over. <laughs> he's gonna be like, "Why are we even here?" But anyway, so this, we're going to react to Richmond, North of Richmond. You've never heard of it. No. So this video has something like 115 million views wow. on YouTube. Wow. Wow. I've been selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours for bullshit pay, so I can sit out here and waste my life away, drag back home and drown my troubles away. It's a damn shame. What the world's gotten to for people like me, people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Oh, it is. Living in the new world. Wow. With an old soul. These rich men know the rich men. Lord knows it all. Just wanna have total control. So they're talking about Washington, D.C., obviously. Richmond, mm -hmm. North of Richmond. Yeah, I'm, but I'm, first impression, what do you think? Man, he, he caught me on the first verse, man. I mean, because I, 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 yeah. I mean, his voice is very good, but the lyrics is strong from the beginning. Mm. I like that. Yeah, that's what I meant, where it's, it's really Love music. It's, it's the universal language, for sure. Lord knows it all, just want to have Yeah, what kind of guitar is that? <laughs> Wish politicians look out for miners. Wow. Not just miners on an island somewhere. Gee. Lord, we got folks in the street, ain't got nothing to eat, and the old beast milk and welfare. Well, God, if you're five foot three and you're 300 pounds, taxes ought not to pay for your bags of fudge drowns. <laughs> Shame. Ooh. What the world's gotten to? People are like that. Man. He gonna become, I'm a little emotional, man. Yeah. That, that He's telling the truth, bro. Where you, where you talking? Because you have, how many kids do you have? Six. Six kids, where he said, I wish politicians would look out for minors. So he's talking about coal miners. Yeah. Not know, just my yeah, yeah. Epstein list. That is. Um, the sad thing is, man, he, he probably won't. Get the recognition that he deserved because he's telling too much truth. You know, but 113 million views, the, the word is out. The, the cool part is, so... The, the rec when I'm talking about the recognition, like, in the... Uh, like the industry. Industry, yeah. Right. With the people, yeah. He's he's on it, man. It's a different world now, it's though, a, man. He's the one typing on people. I just wanted to be part of what he's doing. <laughs> Shake his hand. Hey, dude, I'd be your body guard. Play. Mm. Yeah, I love it. I yeah. love it. Where yeah. is he from? Um, somewhere in Virginia. Um, 
I guess. I don't know. We that's just, that's nice, bro. He's 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 on it. He got solid beard. Too. He took his time with that. Yeah. And I ain't being heard but what a minute of it. And he's got other songs that are just as pop, but this one is the one that blew up. And I think the um, so the the RNC, the Republican Party, was like, "Hey, will you come play at our thing?" And he's like. No, I'm not. He's like, this isn't for Republicans or for Democrats. It's nah. like, <laughs> like both of y'all. Hey, brother. Hey, if you see this, yeah, appreciate you. Me, people like you wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. Your dollar ain't shit, and it's time to know him. Yes, sir. Wow. I'm gonna go to this house, sit in the backyard with a grill, man. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking at here. Yeah. Sit in the deer stand or whatever. I'm gonna go to this man's backyard. I'm selling my soul, working all day. Overtime hours for bullshit pain. Yes, sir. Mm. <laughs> yes, sir, uh, bro. Wow, I like that. That shit makes you want to run through a wall. Yes, yeah, sir. Wow. That was all right, there. So that's Richmond, north of Richmond. That's his name. That's the name he goes no, by. No, so it's Oliver Anthony is his name. Okay, Rich, okay. I guess he's talking about the politicians in D.C. But okay. what what do you think about his voice? What do you think about the voice is uh when he when he first opened his mouth, man, it's he catch you right there. Some people don't know how to do that. Some people are saying you got to wait a few seconds, but as soon as he opened his mouth, this man he, he, is here. You can tell he wrote it. Yeah, he, he can tell he wrote it. He meant it, and it's going. He ain't playing with you. Right. He don't care if you like it or not. Mm-hmm. This is from his heart, and I like that he's genuine. And he so in the in the song he talks about working overtime hours for bullshit pay. That's something we can all relate. Everybody, with. black, white, don't matter who you are, you can you can relate to what everything this man is saying. Mm-hmm. And he wrote it for everybody. Do you listen to much country? I mean, yes, I do. Get Love it. country music. You might not look at me and think that, but I do. I do. I can't name the people, but. <laughs> I know you might ask, who would I, I can't do that one. But I do. I love country music. We well, grew man. up in the South. I mean, it's impossible to avoid it. Man, I love it. Yeah. It's just like any other music, man. You can't sing, you can't sing. Yeah. You ain't writing about nothing, I don't want to hear it. Yeah. What do you think his overall message was for that? It's just sick and tired of being sick and He's tired? He's sick and tired, but he's also trying to open the door. Hey, look, y'all, we, we need help, too. Right. And even though he didn't say it, I feel like as a country, we... We worry about other countries more than we care about our own. And he was saying that without actually saying it. Mm-hmm. It, there is a lot of truth to that. You mm-hmm. see how much money sent overseas, and you're like, geez, the infrastructure yeah. and kind of the priorities are. Yeah. Anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed that. Let us know in the comments what your thoughts are. I know we already reacted to this song with Billy and Chris, um, Young Jock. Let us know if there's anything you want to hear Chris respond to, react to, and I've been trying to get him to start his own channel. He's got a tremendous story. I'll leave I'll leave a link down for your interview that we did. It's been a year or so ago now, yeah. and uh, I learned a lot from it. But man, appreciate it. Oh, I appreciate you, bro. Yeah, man. So leave a comment, smash the like button, and we'll see you in the next one. Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> the thing about that was um. It's just, I'm trying not to get a little emotional here, but uh, I'm not mad at nobody or bitter. A lot of times, still to this day, don't seem fair. And uh, I get to myself, man, I said, man, my kids have so much more if I didn't do this. And I start feeling, and I got to come out of that, man, start feeling sorry for yourself, man. You did a great job, dude.